In this video I will reflect on my performances throughout the year and uh, a bit on my uh, practice routine and um, what I want to do in the future. Uh, the songs I did were I Shot the Sheriff, Ensemble, Skyboat Song in an a cappella trio, Lay Me Down as a Trinity piece, Higher and Higher, and You're Nothing Without Me as a musical duet, and Pick Yourself Up. Uh, firstly, I Shot the Sheriff. I feel that I could have uh, used more dynamics and expression uh, in this song, however I feel the lack of that was down to a little practice as a group, uh, but also as a soloist. In the future, I probably uh, I, well, I'd rather uh, isolate my part um, with a steady rhythm uh, because I feel that I, I was lacking confidence with the uh, the phrasing, and uh, this was what I would do in the future because uh, it would be a more effective practice for me and uh, the rest will fall into place. And then Skyboat Song. Overall I'm pretty happy with the performance. Uh, two points I make uh, to myself are uh, I shall need to watch my volume when singing with others, especially in a cappella, uh, um, because well, I don't think that uh, I drowned them out, but I feel that it didn't blend as well. Um, I definitely was a little less uh, like projective um, when I uh, was unsure of the starting note, and that was usually with the the first um, sustained note, and that was just down to. I would say nerves because I was already disappointed with the first performance so I wanted to make sure I could do well in something that I thought that was going well anyway. So I uh, I think in the future I would probably just drill in, into my mind that the first note is right and uh, I should just go with it and try and uh, sustain it well. Um, but yeah, I just added pressure to myself and that just turned into doubt. Uh, on Lay Me Down, the Trinity piece, uh, to go in with, uh, there was parts where I was happy. I feel like I started the song quite well, but um, as soon as I got into the higher range in the chorus, I kind of uh, saw that from the get-go as a, like a... a a negative for me as it was quite difficult for me to get there even though I'm able to sing the high notes which was the most frustrating part of it. Um, I'm happy with the few sections in the song where I feel that the expression and the tone were really good but then the, the points in the chorus I wasn't very happy with. Uh, I feel there's a lot of improvement in timing as well in that song because as soon as I got to these parts where I was unsure I would lose the phrasing and timing and it would just throw me off and then the structure of the song in the end especially was not ideal because uh, I oversang the verse which I don't know why. Um, higher and higher I feel it was do a weak performance for me because I didn't really show as much um, as a as a soloist, and my expression uh, was not very fitting to the energy and the style of the song. But then, uh, probably my s best performance of the the year was uh, "You're Nothing Without Me." Uh, this was a favorite of mine because. I managed to use a lot of expression and f my timing uh, was much more improved than the rest of my performances and the energy was uh, there throughout. Um, I feel that I got uh, a good encouragement and uh, it made me more comfortable uh, singing the song and it was 
a more familiar kind of style to me as well and all that kind of pushed me to to learn the song more effectively instead of just like singing through the song as I would do in the usual practice and just um, try and get the words right uh, but now with the encouragement of others and kind of focusing in on what I really should be doing which is focusing on the, the weaknesses uh, I managed to get um, sort of the timing and stuff right and then lastly the, the best the most stable performance of the year for me was Pick Yourself Up because that's when everything kind of just clicked. Uh, there was a bit of hesitance in when I started, but um, it didn't show in the when I started. So it, uh, I was kind of unfamiliar when I was going to go f into it. But uh, I just knew when to come in when I did. And I think it's the best example of um, going from uh, the first uh, performance in, in a year to then because it just showed how uh, I learnt to work with an ensemble and fix my timing and expression and um, uh, I wasn't holding the mic wrong or I was uh, doing it better than the first. Um, yeah.